Natumai popote ulipo uko hali shwari kabisa ikiwa na kukaribisha katika kipindi chetu cha Tamba kipindi ambacho kinakuletea wasanii ambao wametamba na kutara tamba kutoka eneo hili la Busi. Jina langu ni Nyamwembe Dennis ukipenda unaita Omwarimu. Leo nipo na msanii ambaye kiukweli sauti yake ni kama kinanda. Ukimsikiliza kimba utadhani ni kama anakuita uje uimbe pamoja na yeye. Tutakuwa tukimjua kabisa tuweze kujua hali na kuwa aje. Eh, kwa sababu hapa ndipo tunawapatia wasanii ambao wamefika na wale ambao wanataka kufika platform sawa kabisa. Beren Koroso. Karibu sana. Asante. <laughs> Ukoje? Uko poa? Labda <laughs> wewe. Pia mimi nipo shwari kabisa. Okay. Nashukuru Mungu anazidi kusaidia. Mm. Mm. Alright, so far so good mwaka uko aje? Mwaka uko poa, si zi complain. Mm. Mm. Malengo yako ambayo ulikuwa umeyaweka mm. yamekaribia kufika katikati. Unajua ah. karibu tunafika mwezi wa sita. <laughs> Uh, at least naendelea kuyatimiza kidogo kidogo. Mm. Mm. Shwari kabisa. Sasa <laughs> ili jina Beren mm. Koroso ni lako? Eh, hilo ni langu. Mm. Mm. Sio labda la kuigiza labda hivi. Hapana, mm. ni yangu rasmi. Mm. Mm. So kwa faida ya mtazamaji ambaye anakutazama sasa hivi, mm. muelezee Beren Koroso ni nani? Oh, uh, Beren Koroso ni mwimbaji kutoka kisi na nafanya rumba na zuk pia yeah naweza fanya jondo nyingine pia but nataka ku jibrand kama wa rumba mm. rumba kabisa mm. inakuwaje unapenda rumba uh, napenda rumba kwa sababu mm. haina stress sana ya ku dance dance mm. jumisi juku dance mm. eh yeah. alafu pia watu kidogo wanaishirikisha na wanadhani wananiambia kuna pesa so unajaribu kuipata <laughs> Ah, yeye ndiye anapata hiyo pesa. Na wewe umeona iko na pesa kweli? Ah. Okay, ah. Ndio naendelea kwa kwenda kwa hiyo njia nione kama nitaona hiyo pesa. Eh, bado sijaanza kupata hiyo pesa. Tutarudi baadaye kwa masuala ya usanii lakini mwanzo kabisa ningependa kujua Beren Koroso alisoma wapi? Kuanzia shule ya msingi, tusonge taratibu mpaka shule ya msingi. Uh, secondary alafu kutoka hapo tueleze. Oh. Mm. Okay, nilisoma Kisumu shule uh, inaitwa Aria Primary. Mhm. Uh-huh. Eh, alafu nikasoma secondary nikasoma Kerer Girls. Mhm. Yeah. Kerer Girls. Mm. Mwaka upi huo sasa ukimaliza? Eh. Na kuona. Wajua nasikianga wana dada wengi ubaki 16 yani. Yeah. Sweet yes. 16. Yes, yes. Eh. Lakini mimi mimi kitu nataka kukuahidi sita kuuliza miaka yako. Lakini ulimaliza form 4. Hiyo sababu naijua vizuri. Ah. Umejua hapo mtu atajua tu by by form 4 kutoka hiyo kwa RAM 17 hivi. Lakini hebu kuulize ni kwa nini wanadada hawapendi kabisa kusema miaka yao? Yaani sio rahisi. Yenyewe I, I think I think ni <laughs> culture. Juu. Eh, eh. Yeah, hata mimi nilizaliwa nili, nili tu na nikapata watu wakisema wanadada hawapendi kusema. Hmm. Eh na sasa hata mimi najipata tu simi sipendi kusema. Hmm. Sawa kabisa. <laughs> sasa tumemalizana na Kereri Girls eh. after hapo nika enda college ya yeah, plan iko hapo Nairobi ni mm. mm. Wow. Huko college ulisomea nini? Tulisomea public relation mm. na front office management. Public 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 relation mambo na PR. Yeah. Kuchocha watu. Eh. <laughs> Sasa hiyo kazi yako ina entail nini? Ina entail kuongea na watu vizuri. Mm. Ya yeah, uko na ile communication skills poa. Mm. Na Bas. Interpersonal lazy ile ya unajua kuishi na watu vizuri. Sasa nataka yeah. chukua hii nafasi yeah. ongea na huyu jamaa mwenye anatutazama ama huyu mwanadada anatutazama yeah. asubscribe kwa Nyamwembe TV. Oh. Mm. Okay. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, na kukaribisha Nyamwembe TV hapa ndo utapata the latest news ya celebrities wote and uh, na kuomba usubscribe and uta regret mm-hmm. i promise i uta regret oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, aki subscribe akibonyeza kuna okay, kitu fulani hapo chini cha red eh, unafinya hiyo bell mm-hmm. every time 
Nyamwembe ana upload kitu unapata unakuwa wa kwanza ku view kabisa mazee. Yeah. Manake katika kipindi chetu cha Tamba hapa ndipo utapata wasanii ambao wametamba mm. na kutaratamba. So ikiwa unawahitaji kwa nini unakosa kusubscribe hapo? Alafu unapata yeah. vitu tamu kabisa kutoka eneo la Gusi. Kabisa mtushajua Berin Koroso amefanya mambo na PR. Mm. Are you still practicing that? Yeah. Hmm. Yes. Oh, mm. Unajua watu wengi usomea hiki baadaye wanafanya kile. Eh. Eh, wana, sasa unapata kuna mm. kuna mvutano mm. kati ya talent mm. na profession. Na profession. Yeah. Hmm. So, mm. kwa mtu ambaye anapitia changamoto ya talent na profession, mm. unaweza ukamwambia nini? Okay, ni muhimu kufanya zote at some point. Mm. Ya yeah, ukijaribu pia kuwe kwa sababu uweziacha moja kama ingine bado ija work out. Kama ingine bado ija eh. jipea. Yeah. Okay, ni yeah. yeah. kweli. Mm. Sasa turudi katika usanii. Mm. Mara yako ya kwanza kugundua kwamba uko na talent ni lini? Nikiwa shule, nilikuwa naimba imba mm. na wanafunzi wangu walikuwa na enjoy. Mm. Mm. Unakumbuka ukiwaimbia wimbo kama gani mmoja? Breathless ya so between the two mm. na sinzia na breathless tutapatia gani so that tujikumbushe hizo enzi za kitambo which one okay. tutapatia kwa chorus kadogo ningependa ningependa kufanya breathless but ni kama nimesahau lyrics so naweza fanya but unaweza fanya chorus tu see you yeah. leave me sauti ya tukupewa lakini inaanza you leave me eh. <laughs> you leave me breathless na la la ni misawa acha nifanye na sinzia twende na sinzia na sinzia nikikuwaza oh okay komita climb and be your defender overpower me so that i surrender who comes akini misawa eh unaweza ukasahau kwa sababu by the way miaka imeenda sana na that song ni kitambo it could be ali 2000 unaelekea age yangu bado no kuna pale tu nitakushika na hiyo age wewe hata kama unaruka kuna pale tu tutashikia umesema utanitaacha oh sasa sa wakati ambapo ulikuwa ukimbia mabeshte zako ama some of your childhood friends walikuwa wanabambika sana eh yeah. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. Unajua wakati mwingine mtu hupata shida sana ya kugundua talanta yake. Yeah. Eh, lakini ukijipata unapenda kuimba imba, mm. unapenda kuongeongea sana. Yeah. Unajua tu basi talent yako kati ya kuimba na mm. kuwa mtangazaji. Yeah, Kitu ambacho kinapendeza sana. Mm. Na na ngoma yako ya kwanza kabisa ilikuwa gani? Ni cover flani ya mid na ita slowly. Slow? Slowly. Oh slowly. Yeah. Wow. That's wewe ni mwaka kama gani wewe? Hiyo ni 2018. 2018. Hivi mm. majuzi tu yani. Mm. Kumbe sio kitambo. Na kuna swali ambalo la watu hupenda kushindwa sana. Mm. Eh ku, kupata ukweli. Mm. Mtu ambaye anafanya cover, mm. sema ni kwa anafanya cover yangu. Mm na the same time ninaimba wimbo wangu mm. so nimefanya cover imepata 1 million views mm. na nimefanya wimbo wangu original umepata 1 million views mm. kati ya hizo nyimbo mbili mm. malipo itakuwa sawa if all factors are kept constant in terms of yeah. maybe the original traffic mm. the length of view mm-hmm. mm. aizi kwa sawa kwa sababu ina depend pia na watch time mhm mm. cuz cuz maybe Originally kwa na a million views mm. but watu wana watch maybe up to 1 minute TV how few up to the, the whole 3 minutes mm-hmm. yeah na maybe cover unapata wana watch the Yote, whole song watu taka wajue yeah. so utapata hiyo cover itakulipa sana sababu watch time yake mm. ni mingi oh mm. because kuna watu wengine kuna watu udanganya kwamba ti cover wakati umefanya cover mm. nyimbo kama umefanya cover ya Damon mm. kama mshirikisha Kofi Lominde baadhi ya pesa zitaenda kwa diamond oh. of which is it true that one i don't know mm, you don't know yeah i don't know wow inapendeza sana yeah. so hadi hapa hivi umefika sasa mm. ni msanii mgeni anakupatianga msukumo wa kutaka kufanya kazi mpaka umfike kiwango chake who is your role model role model especially kutoka kisi mm. 
akikosa okay. kisi mm. uko na ruhusa ya kwenda popote pale <sighs> okay hapo kwa role model sijui necessarily role model wangu ni nani mm. yeah like cause niko na wasani several wenye mimi admire especially nikiona ile time kuna msanii amepata success flani na ndio ina nitumanga sasa na sema eh si hata mimi nijaribu nione kanda pika pale yeah na ni msanii mgani basi kutoka kesi unatamani sana kufanya naye collab mbali na hicho ambacho unajua umefanya juzi mwenye natamani mm. it's sad mm. eh yeah, which finally at least kuna song kuna ka kitu kanakuja yeah, yeah. so watu wategee fate stand featuring koroso yeah. bonge la sauti yes hizo sauti zote zita sumbua yes. sana oh sana eh? yeah. <laughs> so kwa hizo nyimbo zako ambazo umeziimba yeah. which is your favorite my favorite mm. is uh, uh, i can say addictive addictive yeah. mm tuonjeshe tuonjeshe hiyo tuisikie ah. tuone kama hata sisi wende kawa wa favorite <laughs> mm. siku hizi tunakutana tunapendana tunakatiana baada ya muda tunaachana oh, 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 oh siku hizi tunakutana tunapendana tunakatiana baada ya muda tunaachana tuna Baby is all I need if you give me true love I'm gonna be the bad to you cuz I find you addictive Wow sauti Hiyo sauti kwenu ni wewe pekee uko na sauti kama hii Nadhani ah cuz kuna mwimbaji mwingine Kwa line ya jeno kurudi hata kwa kina baba na babu hamna mtu alikuwa akiwa na sauti ya tamu kama kina kinanda hivyo Sidhani kama tuko na mwimbaji mwingine tena eh unless uh, you find out but for now mimi najitoa uh, atujai kwa na msali mm. mm. so kwani wewe ni mtoto wa nambari ngapi mimi ni second last mm. kwa familia ya watoto wa uh, watoto wangapi uh, wa tisa watoto tisa yeah. na nyumbani kabisa kuzaliwa sasa ni wapi ni nyamache nyamache mm. kabisa hizo roots za kwenda ugembo Ogembo. Eh, eh. Ogembo, eh, nyama chenda ni mahali kuna mahali inaitwa Vorangi SDA. Vorangi. Mm. Vorangi kwa bwana hakuna varangi bado wana roho sile. Eh. Oh. Eh, hapa nae. Hapa rangi. Kwa bwana ina morangi. Eh. Varangi bado bado toka kwa chini ya msi. So you know I'm also morangi. Ah, okay. Sasa tuweze tukawana. I think so. Wewe wewe tukeni wa varangi gani? kutoka hizi sides za magwagwa. Oh. Mm. Juu unajua kuna vorangi SD na Sasa G. Oh. Yeah. Sasa mimi yeah. wewe umesema clan yako ni homo rangi. Yeah. Or you are not sure. So I'm not sure. Juu mostly ukipata place inaitwa vorangi, yeah. it could be watore wanaishi hapo hapa rangi. That is subject to confirmation. Yeah. Inapendeza sana. Acha turudi kwa muziki. Nilitaka kidogo tujue unatoka pande gani. Okay. Turudi kwa muziki. Mm. Unadhani changamoto gani msanii wa kike mm. asua wewe <laughs> unapitia katika hiyo huo muziki? Mm. Changamoto ni kupata promotion za song. Mm. Eh, yeah. upate song chezwe. Pata pia interview sometimes. Mm. Yeah. How do you overcome especially hizo za ngoma ichezo juu? I know there are people who can take advantage. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> Sasa ukipia uko na mtu anataka ku take advantage sasa unaacha na kila eh cuz pia wezi mlazimisha. Hmm. Yeah, some want money so kama uko na dog na dipa tu. Hmm. Kama una pia sasa hapo ndio hizo challenges sasa. Hmm. Hmm. Wewe ukipatiwa nafasi ya kusimamia vijana katika eneo la kisi, hmm. unaweza ukafanya mapinduzi gani kuhakikisha kwamba hasol ya kila mtu kijana mm. inalipa hususan kama waigizaji mm. au wasanii juu mimi nimetangamana mm. na wasanii wengi wanapenda kulia sana oh mm. mazee hatuna kakitu hatuna kitu jina By kubwa way. jina ni kubwa hapa nje hata unajua wengi wao waogopa waogopa <laughs> kutumia boda boda juu wana mm. wanasema mazee nikitoka hivi nje ni shida so utafanya nini so that at least yeah. kuna kakitu kwa mfuko wa wasanii kitu inaweza saidia wasanii ni platform yeah like organize vitu zenye maybe a concert anything to my show mm. eh penye wanaenda wanafanya kazi yao na wanapata kitu mm. yeah see kwa sababu wanapata watu wengine wana organize wanataka kwa kompo free mm. stay in the challenge wanakuita cut and raise organize yeah. 
professional and then at some point too at what I would understand I was a perform for free. I would have thought one of the but I can't do it. But yeah, but at least I would perform for free. Who was the first person Kabisa Kokopatia platform? The first person. So that you can actually show your talent. I think it's uh Fred Bubat. Fred of Bat Machoka. Yeah. Ulena Baka Roga Roga. Yeah. Ukaroga what? Yeah. Well, it's amazing. Raja what wengi. What wengi was who they don't forget the first person. Yeah. Kum Patia chance at least to showcase talent. Yeah. Because it's something in a bamba sana. Sana. Mm-hmm. So mesema so far so good YouTube channel yako tunakupata aje? Na nipata Berlin Corroso. Mm. Yeah, everywhere. Facebook, YouTube. Kwa kila mtandao, mi naitwa tu Berlin Corroso. Mm. Berlin Corroso maze. Kimbia Berlin Corroso YouTube channel, mm. subscribe. Ukisha subscribe unajua unafanya nini? Unabonyeza hicho kitufe macho kinakaa kama kengele so that wakati wote wale ambao wanatupia tupia mambo mazuri pale unakuwa wa kwanza kupata uondo wa sauti tamu kama ya kinanda mm. eh kabisa <laughs> so eh eh huyu mtu huyu kuna mtu hapa nje anashangaa yeah. Beren Koroso kuna mtu ambaye kabla lale lazima mpigie simu <laughs> eh Eh mbona unicheka kwanza nikati huko. Iko. So watu wacheza chini. Eh acha acha tuongelee your latest project. Ngoma ambayo mmefanya na Mheshimiwa Echete. Eh how was it kuchapa kazi na msanii Echete? It was amazing. Yeah. He's such an amazing guy. As in, despite ako na fan base kubwa kunishinda mimi, hako nisumbua na alijimepia available which I really appreciate. Actually, we wanna kire neza kwa problem. Like, kumbata, skuya shoot. But it was very easy. Yo patia kana sema mtoto koroso juu ni nini nini? Patia patia kwa shana na yake. I wanna hold you Baby, go somewhere and you can come my team To fall in the end, Zeki, baby, yeah So, what do you see in me? Mmm, it's shaky, yeah, I'm on the door When you find out my violin, it's shaky, yeah, I'm on the door Mmm, it's shaky, yeah, I'm on the door So, I'm on the door, so I'm on the door so call go to the denge yeah wow so call go to the denge so call go to the denge so call go to the denge Mm-hmm. Wow, it's amazing. Thank you. Tunaimba vizuri. Mm-hmm. Lakini kuna jamaa anasema wasanii wa kisiwa hapa na pride. Ah. Tanana yeye. Unajua mm. the moment umefanya kitu mm. kama wewe unaona like venye umefungua hii YouTube TV hapo ukaanza na one subscriber in fact zero subscribers say you are six mm. and uh, ile time maybe ulikuwa na zero subscribers ukikuja mtu simu anaku snow watu hata wataki story yako mm. so ile time we achieve it it's always you, you need to feel proud so mimi sio ningama kwa shida hakuna hakuna shida inafaa tukuwe proud mm. yeah ukitoa kwa two step he ukaenda the next step hata mm. kama si kubwa mm. so long as you're not where you used but to be. now to where should we cross the line usidarau mtu eh usidarau mtu na siringe pia yeah but you need to be proud of yourself mm-hmm. yes so wewe unapigia upate msanii kukua na kiburi try ni kiburi mm-hmm. no <laughs> no <laughs> <laughs> okay kiburi kwa kizungu ni 
Kiburi haitoch ni kwa kichwa ngumu ama Sina hakika lakini mwisho wa siku mm. the way umeelezea iko sawa sababu yeah. ile hustle wasanii wengi najua wanapitia pa nje mm. angalau kuhakikisha kwamba jina lao linasalia kwenye ramani yes. mm. it is worth actually mm. to be proud of yourself yes yeah. unajua pride ni mm. ile kukuwa satisfied mm. with what you've done mm. yeah which is perfectly okay it's not so much easy it's not easy especially kwa industry si rahisi so it is okay to be proud but mm. no way to cross the line yeah you see that our art you don't mm. treat people badly mm. simply because you make great gina mm. yeah but but feeling proud mm. yeah so unajua ile time kama hujajulikana ukipigia hata mtu simu mtu anapo hata ishiki sometimes hakuna mtu anataka kusikia story yako yeah so it's, it's important to feel that Right. Yeah. Pale wasanii ambao wanakuwa ukitia hustle sana. Sana. Eh, hey, industry series. Mm. So wewe ulikabiliana uli ngaje na hizo changamoto za msanii anaye? Bado nakabiliana nazo hadi mm. sasa. Eh. Moja ikiwa ni gani? Najua ushasema hiyo ya kupata ya platform sio? Kupata platform. Mm. Mm. So wewe bado ni upcoming artist kweli? Korosa unajia. Okay, mimi wewe unajia. Na una kama una na upcoming? Mm na artist amaji me iko ready mm. eh niko somewhere hapo so katikati katikati yeah, so wewe ukajirate yeah. kama coming ama yule ambaye amefika kiwango okay mimi si upcoming sana mm. yeah, but pia bado sijafika bado na nangana mm. mm. sasa mwenyezi Mungu akikubariki ufike mm. pale level unataka mm. what will you do to make sure that you maintain ju wengi wengi by the way mm. wengi ufika hapo na unajua ni vigumu sana kufika kiwango fulani okay. lakini ni rahisi sana kushuka sasa wewe unaonaje ukifika utafanya nini uhakikishe kwamba usishuke consistent hmm. Hmm. consistency is the key baby yeah kwanza ukishafika huko juu alafu hmm. unakata kutoa ngoma hmm. utasahaulika hmm. so like ukishajulikana unajaribu ukwe consistent unatoa ngoma ya yeah, kama mwenye anaanza wewe mm. unakuwa na ile bidi kama vile ulikuwa nayo mm. ile time bado ulikuwa unaanza okay mm. sasa siku za hivi karibuni watu watarajie nini kutoka kwako watarajie collabs kwa wingi actually ni in my is in niko nayo plan ya kufanya collab sana mm. Mm. so like venye nimesema kuna collab yangu na Fate Stan mm-hmm. si wawili mm-hmm. kuna collab yangu na Fate Stan na msanii mwingine mm-hmm. kuna collab anaitwa Foreman msanii mm-hmm. kuna collab yangu na Mashwanda mm-hmm. ya yeah, na mimi mwenyewe pia zangu solo singles zitakuja kibao ya yeah, rumba sana sana wow mm-hmm. bas chukua hii nafasi kuongea na shabiki wako okay um, shabiki wangu na furai sana kwa na nakushukuru kwa kukuwa shabiki wangu um nachukua fursa kukusihi uende youtube u subscribe kwa channel yangu uni follow pia facebook na um yeah na ufinye hiyo bell sisahau so that any time niki niki upload video unapata hiyo notification wa kwanza mm-hmm. yeah tukiongea kuuzu ku eh wa no masana <laughs> hii kama hii kofi inaleta shida acha ni kuuzu mm-hmm. acha ni toyo kuuzu ilete kuuzu <laughs> e, tukiongea kuuzu mashabiki mm-hmm. e, acha nichukue huo muda ku big up baadhi yao ambao wana support sana ambao mm. utufuatilie kila siku yani na inapendeza sana ningependa kuanza na Timo Karimazi asante sana kwa kuzidi ku support kuna thanks mose kuna kuna huyu hapa anapotea acha nimtafute eh kuna fra eh namna gani Franklin Mariola kuna Franklin Mariola kuna Miss D eh, kuna Helen Mongina kuna Priscilla Osiemo kuna Denomax 254 kuna Masai Mkisi kuna Nyaemos eh bonga la jina ile kuna Malenga Ondeki Liverson Babu G almost science mwenyewe na kucheke kabisa alafu kuna mwingine anajiita Lilian Nyavs kuna Agri Nyakundi kuna eh, Joseph Ratemo kuna MC Brighton TV kuna Vena V ABC XYZ eh, majina mengine walai shida sana. Cyprian Kambuni kuna Willy Bisera Machuki Famakias Kemunto Asiago upande wako unaonaje mambo hapo? 
Upande wangu naona Charles Lilian Kemunto KE naona Bamora naona la V254 ninaona V QT naona Eng <laughs> ni kama ni short form ya engineer Zachary naona Michael Mogendi Mairima Mary M Peter Ntabo mm-hmm. yeah Uh, Peter Dennis kuna Mali Safi kuna Said Thoya kuna Alice Mongina Mongina kuna Enoch Moseti Evans Michira kuna Baron Boss kuna Frida Mosi Mosiria Joyce Kemto na Bonju Kevin kuna vile vile Gesami Samu kuna Mary M kuna Damaris Nyaboke Gladys O e moseti nya kweba na wengine wengi tumalizie upande wako okay upande wangu kuna Jacqueline Mukeira Fanisa Fanisa Wiki Simple Boy kuna William Marube kuna Valentine Lifestyles kuna Naomi Tamazo kuna Boke eh, ni wengi James Oseko Vena Otino ya yeah. Rispa Guaro Masai Mkisi Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah. Asante asante sana kwa kusupport kila siku mm-hmm. na kuhakikisha kwamba kipindi cha Tamba kinatambaa na kutaratamba eh, katika eneo lolote lile ambalo upo. Ikiwa unapenda kutazama kutoka eneo la Ugaibuni, unapenda kutazama kutoka huko nchini Kenya mazee nasema asante sana kwa support yako. Hadi hapo tumefika tamati ya kipindi chetu yani kipindi kimekuwa ni tamba labda kama korosa una jambo la mwisho ah uh, pana niko mm. sawa niko shwari kabisa yeah. bas nakutakia wakati mwema na Mwenyezi Mungu akulinde jina langu ni Nyamwembe Dennis kama unaita omwarimu